we are just over halfway through the 2023-24 championship season. So it's time, I guess, for a half-term quiz, just over half-term. And who better to put to the test than the nation's premier EFL expert is David Prutton. Prut, wow. how much I mean, attention have you been paying to the season so far? Uh, as much attention as I have done to that introduction, which was <laughs> uh, wonderfully all over the place. But yeah, now I'm looking forward to it. It's, it's good for the old grey matter and we'll soon see whether... I can uh, walk the walk. I have 20 questions for you, and each answer is a championship team. So should we get started and crack on, yeah, shall we? Uh, question one, an easy one to Go. put us in. Who does the top scorer in the championship this season play for? <laughs> oh, God. Blackburn Rovers. Yes. Question two. Which two clubs have seen players score hat-tricks this season? Oh, my word. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Uh, Hull City. Yes. And hat trick, hat trick, hat trick, hat trick. I'm gonna say someone like Leicester. Plymouth Argyle. Oh! Morgan Whitaker and Ozan Two fan of City, of course. Question three: Who has fielded the youngest player in the championship so far this season? The team notorious for playing young players regularly. Really? Mm. Notorious. Notorious. Bleed. No. Who? Sunderland. Ah. Oh! <laughs> Chris Rigg, who was 16 years, two months and 15 days when he played against Southampton in September. Question four, this has gone terribly so far. Who fielded the oldest player in the championship so far this oh season? QPR. Birmingham City. John Ruddy, who was 37 years, Is two months and eight days. John? He's 37, John My Ruddy, yes. God. Question... So old. <laughs> Stop playing, you're ruining me. <laughs> Question five, which two clubs have the players with the most yellow cards so far this season? They both got 10 yellow cards apiece, these players. Leeds United. No. Why do I think Leeds are either dirty or I don't know. <laughs> uh, most of the cards, two clubs. Two players. Two players from two different clubs? Two different clubs. Two answers to this. Stoke City. Yes. Ben Pearson. Ben pa oh, I, if I had to get, I mean, and I love Ben Pearson as a player, I think he's fantastic, but if he just got booked in the tunnel and get it sorted <laughs> before he gets on the pitch. Uh, and the other one. And the other one would be Cardiff City. Ipswich Town, Sam Morsey. No way. Yeah, Sam Morsey. That's fine. Which club has the oldest permanent manager this season at this point, of course? I mean, this could all change in 24 it's good, hours. This could change, but the, this guy is quite unlikely to get sacked in the next 24 hours. Mark Robbins. It is Mark Yeah. Robbins. Four years old. Of course, Nigel Pearson was older, but he's no longer at Bristol was, City. Yeah. Who is the youngest permanent manager currently at a championship club this season? Danny Rill. It is Danny Rill. Yes! Four years old. How old? 34. Ridiculous. Yeah. Which two clubs... I'm 34. That's I know. terrifying. I mean, that's like yeah. you being in charge of people. I know. It's horrible, horrible thought. Uh, question eight. Which two clubs have won and lost the same number of games this season? Now, does that mean they're doing badly or they're in the middle? Well, it mean they're in the middle. They're a big rivalry based around a river. <laughs> right, OK. <laughs> based around a river? Yeah. Now, your geography is terrible, <laughs> so I think this you might be wrong here. Talk about something in space. Yeah. Swansea. No. Close. Right. Close to Cardiff. Oh, um, Cardiff and Bristol City. Seven side derby. That is really good, actually. Yeah. yeah. I when, when you said that, I thought you thought that Cardiff and Swansea were separate. No. But I did see. <laughs> no. Uh, Cardiff have won and lost 11 games. Bristol City have won and lost 10 games. Wow. Okay. Question... Nine. This is the best thing you've done. I know, it's incredible, isn't it? <laughs> Which club has conceded the most goals so far this season? This should be an easy one for you. I'm going to go with Rotherham. It is Rotherham. 50 goals conceded so far this season. Which club has gone on the longest losing run so far this season? It's one or two. It's definitely one or two. Huddersfield. No. Birmingham City. No. Oh, it's Queens definitely... Park Rangers. No way. Games. Yeah. Question 11. Which club has been involved in the joint biggest home and away wins this season? Watford. It is Watford. Yay! Yes. They won 5 0 at home versus Rotherham and 5 1 away at Preston. I knew that. Question 12. Which club has been involved in the two highest scoring games this season? Late. No. One more guess. All right. Leicester. It's Norwich City. I was going to say Norwich. They drew 4 4 at Southampton and lost 6 2 at Plymouth. Uh, Question 13. Which two clubs mm -hmm. are losing the most players to Athcon and Asian Cup this month? West Brom? No. Jeez. You get one more guess. Ten, I've got one more guess for two clubs. If you, if you get the next one wrong, then. If you get the next one right, you can have another one. If you get the next one Leicester wrong, City. Not. Leicester City are one. Who are the other? Birmingham City. It's Middlesbrough. What? Middlesbrough are losing Senny Dieng, Riley McGree and Sam Silvera. 
and Leicester City are losing to Kelechi and Nacho, Pat Sandaka and Harry Suter. Right. Forget okay. about the Australians of the Asian Cup, I think. Yeah, I completely forgot about that. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Question 14. Most yellow cards so far this season, which club? Leeds United. No. One more guess. Birmingham City. No. <laughs> I just feel the net. No. I, I don't know why I keep getting Birmingham. Birmingham went a long time ago. <laughs> did it? Yeah. No way, did it? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I don't even cross it out. <laughs> I mean, the editing of this will, will this be... This is going to be a nightmare. It'll be a war Thank you. Um, it's Southampton, 67 yellow cards so far this season. No way! And who has got the fewest yellow cards so far this season? Right, so by process of elimination... I'll give you a clue. It's the team you've guessed for every dirtiest category so far this season and the cleanest. And they're the cleanest. Leeds United. It is Leeds United. Leeds United have got cards, the fewest so yellow cards. 40 and yellow cards. Southampton cards. have got the most. Yeah, you never would have guessed, would you? I mean, you literally didn't. Well, uh, I, mean, I don't want to cast aspersions, but Southern Soft is Northern Hard Men. Yeah. One team that passes the life out of everyone. That, that shows your prejudices are wrong, <laughs> as always. Question 16. Who is the goalkeeper with the most clean sheets so far this season? Which club? West Brom. It is West Brom. Alex Palmer's kept 12 clean sheets so far Obviously. this season. Obviously. Question 17. Which club has spent the longest spell without a permanent manager so far this season? Really, really not up to date on the rules of this competition. <laughs> Millwall. It's Swansea City. Ah! How long has it been? 32 days without a manager has it been between sacking Michael Duff and hiring Luke Williams. Yes. Question 18. Which was the first club of the remaining clubs to part company with a manager this season? Oh, Huddersfield Town. It was Huddersfield Town. Neil Warnock. Uh, question 19 we have just two teams left Preston and Millwall which of those two clubs has scored more goals so far this season is this a red herring given where they both are in the division I'm going to go Preston I mean they're 14th and 15th in the league I know but one's been near the top I know yeah it is it is Preston yes 31 goals so I'll think me and 28 to Millwall and finally a Millwall question to finish (laughs) us off who is Millwall's top scorer so far this season? Tom Bradshaw. It is not Tom Bradshaw. Oh, um, One more. Dean guess. Fleming. No, it's Kevin Nisbet who scored what? so far this, this season. This is rubbish. Uh, I think you got about zero out of twenty-four there. <laughs> so yeah. That, I mean, that was as as tough quizzes go. That was up there with my GCC. Marks. I hope you do more research for the rest of the season. Yes. We'll do this at the end of the season, but for now, you can follow the rest of the Sky <laughs> Championship season on Sky Sports. <laughs>